The rain stopped listening to the birds. They've all come out to play. Um, another area, we've got a massive, massive, I don't know what's happened here previously, but we've got a huge dip in the lawn here, which is an absolute nightmare when I'm cutting it. So again, uh, I've got a load of soil. Um, but it's got a load of rocks in and a load of dirt in, uh, uh, like big, big bowls and what have you. And I'm just sort of wondering if that's going to work at the minute. If I, if I put that into there, um, which let me show you around the other side. It sort of worked on the other side, and I think what's happened, whether you've seen our disaster zone already, um, I don't know. But obviously. You, if not, I'll put a link up coming up now with our disaster zone for our other bit of lawn, um, which was sort of similar to to this. It was it was the same sort of material, a sandy sort of soil, full of rocks um, that were put over the big lawn at the front. Um, will all this before before I go whacking barrows and barrows and barrows full of this into that dip? Um, is this going to be all right? And do I just leave it? Do I let this now give give this a week? See how it goes. Once I've rolled, obviously this all needs rollering in, so um, it gets a little bit closer. There's still a fair bit of a dip in the middle, which I think I'm just going to let this settle. Um, let the grass come through, and I think the grass is going to come through just naturally. Uh, I think as this gets rolled, we get a bit of rain. Um, I think the grass is just going to naturally come through. You can see in areas where it's already poking through. So I don't think I've killed, I don't think I've destroyed this area. I think I just need to build it up a little bit more. Um, and it's going to be interesting to see, because as I say, that is, it's, it's the soil that I'm putting down. Uh, I'm being a bit of a cheapskate. I'm being a bit of a cheapskate, aren't I? Um, by using this soil but instead of having it all grabbed away because I've got out, out of where we had it all dug out there's there's absolutely tons there must be over a hundred tons of this stuff that I've got um, which if I could use this and get it to work properly as a bit of a, a filling for areas probably not the top dressing um, but just just an actual leveler uh, that I can roll her in live with the stones and then I've, I've got a, a an area that I can put a top dressing onto. Um, so yeah, whether it's going to work, I don't know. I'm sort of doing these videos at the minute, um, just so that we've got some content. And again, before I sort of go too crazy on what I'm doing and trying to get a bit of a, a plan of action, and then start spreading a load of rubbish over the grass that I shouldn't be spreading over. Uh, and I'm not. I'm not really. For the, for the other areas I don't need to this needs a, a top dressing I think it doesn't need a massive massive building up uh, like some of the, the other lawn that disaster area that I've shown and that other little piece of lawn there that I was just showing you just go back round there um, so it's just it's just a bit of an infill uh, and I think I can use the same stuff that we've got round the back on this area um, you can see this here now. Let me get the camera around. You can see it's absolutely massive. Uh, now to try and use some sort of top dressing, um, I think it needs building up first. It just needs that dip filling, filling back in properly, um, because it's an absolute nightmare to cut. And I've not, I've not cut this grass yet. This hasn't been cut this year at all. Um, and I'm sort of wondering, do I fill this in now? Do I give it a week or so to see how the other side comes through? Or do I just go for it? Um, let me know in, your com in the comments. Have you done anything similar and how did it work for you? Um, is it going to work? I think it will. I think it will. I'm fairly confident that it will. Um, I need to give it a, a good week or so to see how the back bit goes, see how that area that I've just shown you there, um, but I think that would work, it's just going to be 10 or 20 barrow falls of it in here, 
and it's just going to make it just an awful lot easier and again it's just all about at the minute just trying to get a base to actually work with something that i can start to get the lawns a little bit level and make it a little bit easier to cut and i think this is the perfect time of year to do it we're sort of april now um so everything's just getting to that point where we're going to have to start cutting the grass more often now and I think this, this is the time that I need to do it, so I need to know in the comments fairly quickly um, what you think that I should do. Help me out. Um, thanks for watching. If you've not already, hit the subscribe button, hit the like. Hopefully the videos are going to get better the more that I do. Uh, it's still a brand new channel, so um, give us a bit of support and uh, give us some advice if you've got any. Thanks for watching.